All right, so it's Cinco de Mayo, and um, it is 8.30 at night. So um, needless to say, uh, we've had a pretty busy weekend, and um, yeah, so I didn't have a lot of time to do this workout. I've had this workout kind of in my back pocket for a couple months, um, just kind of keeping it there, um, because it's a perfect workout if you are uh, strapped for time and you just need a good 10 minute workout um, that's intense um, and you really will start feeling it um, the next day. So um, what it is, is it's kind of a CrossFit-ish, I know it's kind of a buzzword, but um, it's um, CrossFit-ish. Um, you're basically doing all sevens, you're doing seven rounds, three moves, seven reps each um, for seven rounds. They're very simple. You will need some equipment for this, um, for the squats, and that's it. So what you're going to be doing is, um, ah, let me move this. I was in such a hurry that I have my old trainers with the loop that's like busted, but I just needed to grab whatever I had and because I just, I'm like, 10 minutes, that's all. I've got a 10 minute workout and I've got to shoot the video and that's it. Okay, so basically seven burpees and you're gonna be doing um, champion um, burpees, which you're gonna lay down on the ground and push up and then jump up. So going down, put your belly on the ground and then push up and jump up. So the side view, what that looks like is, um, Going down, lowering yourself down so you're not just plopping down and you're not doing like the worm when you go up. So you want to like do like an L, like a push up and then jump up. You'll do that seven times and then you'll go straight into, so there's no breaks. You're just going straight out um, for time. I was able to finish in nine minutes, 36 seconds. Okay, so you got, you're want to gonna put weight on your shoulders. Um, you can do um, free weights, holding free weights in your hands as well. And so you're gonna be doing some weighted squats. Knees over your ankles when you're on the squat and then squeeze the glutes on the up. So what that looks like is just like this. Okay, seven of those. And then you're gonna go straight into seven push up, um, sit ups. You're not going to do just a standard sit-up, you're going to do a frog sit-up, which basically means you're going to um, um, separate your knees and then bring your hands like that. That's pretty much what the top view would look like. So, and you're not letting your feet touch the ground so, or your hands. To make it harder, you lift your, your head up and that will um, increase the challenge for you. So, basically like this. All right, so then you'll do seven of those for seven rounds. So like I said, it's like 8.30 at night. Um, I, need, I still haven't even eaten dinner. It has been a crazy, wonderful weekend. I mean, crazy in a good way weekend. We did so much. We had a family dinner date, the three of us, on Friday. Um, that was great, and we went to the convenience store and splurged and got some Haagen-Dazs ice cream. Seth got Rocky Road, and I got blueberry crumble. It was delicious. And um, Saturday, um, and I was able to do a workout on Friday too, so no excuses there. Um, Saturday, no workout, but we did so much. We went to consignment stores and we picked up a high chair, kind of space saver, um, off of um, Craigslist-ish kind of site. And so we picked that up. Um, we priced some gates because Eva is army crawling now. And... Um, my goodness, um, we just did like a bunch of errands. It was, it felt really good. Um, we got to go see, we went to a barbecue at a friend's house, kind of just last minute. Um, and that was just so fun um, to be able to do that and see the boys jump on the trampolines and just, it was really good. And then getting home, um, and then today was um, six month photo shoots for Eva um, and family photos at the park and then afterwards we got to just kind of lay down for a little bit and soak up some of the sun. Um, I went to baby shower uh, and that was super fun. Um, and I got to hold a newborn baby. Um, 
lots of fun stuff today, um, all weekend. And so we're moving um, into Monday, and I have written out um, four new workouts um, that I kind of lazily just got from uh, the Daily Hit website. I'm like, I just need something this week because I have a feeling this is going to be a really busy week. Um, so I need something that I could just quickly turn to. So um, those are those. And I'm going to test out those workouts. Um, I tweak them if I feel like they're not challenging enough um, or I just don't really agree with the move and I feel like there's a different way to do that move. So we will see. Um, that's it. Until next time.